knew. But John thinks that for some reason he was such a scary talent. I just don't. I hate. I hate the term main character. I don't know. It feels yeah. weird coming out of his mouth. Main character. Yeah. And Somebody sent me like, oh god, god, god. Sorry. Yeah, he says the main character. On. What, you know, how much there? I don't know. I, I'm not getting involved in this. Show. All I do. But is, now you are. But I. All I do is make a joke. I. I. Oh, and I text or on Twitter. I went to start a job. Hey, I was joking. Loosen up. All right. It was a joke. And obviously, Chad got it. There. So there's Shredder trying to raise back. LOL, I just saw this. Right after his whole <sighs> diatribe, whatever it was. <laughs> right. So, anyhow, this podcast. He had it right there, Rich. He did. Get confident, stupid. Yeah, he actually figured it out. <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, now they're going to come for me. The name of a. Uh, Take back everything I said. Who are these podcasts? <laughs> reviewed it all and i'm sure i think they've trashed us i'm sure they, I think they, they, they haven't they should i they think should <laughs> stop touching the microphone buddy stop it <laughs> <laughs> i love this thing like trashed us we reviewed your show and trash found some flaws <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Come on, like that, done better. That's yeah awesome. i like how carl sets it up like sometimes we really love the podcast we're reviewing <laughs> yeah right could you imagine oh that's that's happened a couple of times uh, the most famous one was Michael Rappaport because uh, Andy and his brother came over and, you know, the show format of WTP is like, let's rag on this podcast. They come over, they're like, yeah, what about this fucking guy? I'm like, I love him. He's great. <laughs> <laughs> You're not charismatic. I was just like, no, I, I think everything about this show is hilarious. And uh, I really enjoyed it. Oh, uh, my God. I really sad back those guys with that one. I think they call this a uh, right. bickering couple or something. I hate when people do that. I know. But anyhow... They were reviewing Reminds the whole... Reminds me of listening to my parents. Don't you, your parents ever this funny? I didn't say that, by the way, Bonnie. Just so you know. I said you were a bickering couple. I didn't say you reminded me of my parents. Well, Sorry. The head of that podcast... People think this is easy to do? This when ain't I, easy. I think when I was in Rochester... A guy Living that, with this man? When I was in Rochester, I think that uh, Vinny, who has a podcast up there, I think he said, you don't like those guys. I don't, I don't even know him, but maybe I don't. Who? The, one that reviewed us. Oh, the Pay attention! Who are these podcasts we're talking about? I uh, mean, in Body's defense, it's a tough follow. No, I, uh, I understand. It's a, it's a lot going on. Yeah. I don't know if I do or don't. I don't even know if I... We ever... liked him yesterday or the day before well, whatever. We listened boss is better than all of them. And you're like, mm, this guy knows his shit. Well, I mean, when it comes to comedy, he's saying, you know, the guy that... Who's the main guy on uh, Who Are These Podcasts? He was good. The guy... I'm not going to lie. The guy was carrying his podcast. He had some other comic who was a guest on, probably a middle. By the way, Voss is very good here. He's doing a very good job. He's good. You know, he's making a lot of good points right now. I don't know if yeah, you guys right. picked up on that. Yeah, right. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Corn Dev, I mean, Voss is doing a good job right now. Am I wrong? This is, he's, uh, he's yeah, up. I mean, he's, like, he's talking pretty, pretty, pretty good about you. Making some good points. Yeah, Corn Dev's pissed. He hasn't mentioned him yet. He's not going to give him <laughs> yeah. his prop. You got to go pretty deep into WTP to get the Corn Dev. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and, you know, he he was showing clips from Stutter and John. He was, uh, you know, going over the whole thing, going, it was a fucking joke. So uh, he he was good. I'm not going to lie. Even if they trash our podcast, which I'm sure they have, but they're not, they can never trash your stand up or my stand up because we're fucking amazing. But the guy was good. Anyhow, he reviewed the whole thing. And I'm like, I'm like, a lot of people do not like this stuttering John guy. Like, brilliant observation right there. <laughs> that, this is fantastic. So, uh, I hate to use the word dabble because I, that got Chrissy Mayer in trouble with she got stuttering John. Chrissy got in trouble. You don't know Chrissy for years. She got in trouble for saying dabble. She, she was interviewing. I think it was the funniest thing ever. Like, Reddit, why is that bad? She was. She was. Inter <laughs> it's not bad. She was interviewing um, stuttering John Melendez, and she's all. So you still dabble in comedy? And he got all fucking bent out of shape over it. He like he like what? super bent out of shape for him. What do you think that meant? It's got lore. I, I think he thought that she didn't respect him as a comedian. Oh, none of us do. Why would we have a possible yeah, respect? Because they, he, because he knows that it got to him. So it, and then of course you guys are just. Oh, like, she just said it, and I bet she wasn't even trying to. She wasn't trying to say it. No, no, sweet. no. She's not mean. No, she's not. She's not mean. It's it's funny. <laughs> Kurt Metzger. That's the greatest line ever. Uh, I think that like he felt he wasn't respected as a comedian. Yeah, no, no one respects Chad as a comedian. 
Yeah, right, I mean, wait, I think he's not known as a comic because he never did the work to be a comic. He got booked because he was on The Tonight Show. He got booked because he was on Stern and he was friends with Florentine and, and, and all these other comics that were always looking for a break, always looking for the next thing to get them to the next stage. Those guys were working. Those guys were hustling. He was playing 15 minutes of his interviews and then doing seven, eight minutes of uh, Gary Teeth jokes yeah. and then taking 80% of the money. Well, don't forget about his amazing crowd work, though, too, Shuley. Oh. You two, are you guys fucking? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> oh, I asked you that already? Sorry. <laughs> Um, I got to get caught up on Super Chats. You guys are being very generous. And I appreciate that. Uh, before I... A lot of those Super Chats are fake. <laughs> and that's a fact. That's my favorite thing. I think a lot of Super Chats <laughs> are fake. And that's a fact. Fact. Is it a fact that you think it? What do you mean that's a fact? <laughs> so facts work, dummy. <laughs> that was the day where he put out a tweet saying, I have it on good authority that it's all fake. <laughs> right. And then he did. And then he did the same exact exact shit. Uh, hey, baby. How are you? Feel much better. Hey, look at Feel more you. energized. I realized what it was. You start out well, guys at the end of the like, show. Since, You're a drunken fool. This is like day, day nine. Nine. But, um. <clears throat> you can still hear the phlegm. But I just realized the fucking Slim Fast in the morning ain't doing it. So I just got done with some fucking bacon and eggs. No bread. Of course. Oh, no, you're healthy. No bread. Smart person knows uh, that you're supposed to microwave the bacon. It comes out nice and crispy. Listen, listen to this one. I had three eggs over easy. Two of these. Two small OJs. And now I feel fine. So, where do we begin? I see the lies being put forth by, by the shit network. Fans. Ours, and Lady K are still prevalent. And you sheep are believing all of it. Your own and I will be addressing just bust your chops. The, the one that pays I mean, two dollars. It's every day. A dollar. It's every fucking bust day. You. A new lie. A new lie shall be born and my light is falling down. Uh, just stay up for one more day, will you? I just ordered another fucking light. Another ring light. This one with fucking a screw. Can't you do all this before bitch. you press go live? So hopefully, it's probably just gonna start fucking fading. I don't need to fucking. Fuck, it's just fuck, a being held fuck, together fuck. by tape. Very eloquent. That's how immense people speak. But of course, because I ordered a new one today, now this one's gonna really give me a problem. Hasn't given me a problem at all, but now it will. But anyway. And then Bob had the audacity to say that he doesn't lie. Okay, Bob. Okay. This idiot. Bob is playing the audio from some uh, another clip. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's that's how it goes. Okay, yeah. It's because yeah, you don't know what you're more. doing. Andrew, he's jealous oh, of oh, Adam. This is the this is the best one. Um, Major, let me just bring you in for a second. Hey, Army Major. What's up, man? All right, I'm just gonna play this, and then we'll uh, and then we'll go to talk about how disgusted is the Army Major uh, with this? He's gotta be right. The, isn't it funny? He says how how disgusted is the Army Major after he just sneezed yeah, we'll on the floor. Andrew, uh, he's jealous oh, of oh, Adam. This is the this is the best uh, one. He's just Army Major. Let me bring you in for a second. Floor. Hey, Army Major. What's up, man? Right, I'm just going to play this, and then we'll, and then we'll go. How disgusted is the Army Major with this? He's got it. Fucking douche. Let's see. Uh, yeah, he can't find whatever he's looking for. Oh, this is the best. Up. So, Quad. He'll wipe me over. This is Shuli admitting that he can't do anything but watch me. Turn on accept gifted memberships. Why did that happen? 
You notice? That's what I mean. That's beautiful. What are you doing, stupid? I think I gotta just turn the audio off on every single one. <laughs> Is that it? What? Well, whatever you're doing is working so far, so get to that one again, I guess. Try it again. And then expand it right when you get to it. He is. Give mm -hmm. 10 members uh, that are all fake, according to John. Then you will... It doesn't push play on this one, though. See if it works. Just oh, push okay. play on the one you want. Okay. They don't care if it ain't true. To hit the same beat. To fucking eat it up. Come on. Don't waste it. Uh, Bob, you were... What the fuck happened? Like, hit subscribe, and please turn on accept gifted memberships. So when a gentleman like Dill to push play on this one. Yeah, I'm so just push play again. Hit stop. Yeah, hey, I'm just going to do it like this. I don't saying something bad about me. That's not true. We listen to an idiot talk, and we talk on it. I don't give to fucking eat it up. To fucking eat it up. They don't care if it ain't true. They just care that somebody is saying something bad about me. That's not true. We listen to an idiot talk and we talk on it. I don't give a fuck about anything else. Exactly. It's rare that we have a different agenda on the show. And a lot of times we've tried it. It hasn't, it hasn't gone great. You know what I mean? Like, this is what I like to do. This is what I want to do. The three of us laughing at this idiot. That's it. I mean, it's just amazing. It, I, 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 so, come on. So, so Shirley's admitting that without me, he can't... Everything else that he tried failed. Right? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I actually was... So when I started seeing Chili um, on Anthony's show, I went out and checked out his YouTube channel.